What's up everybody, it's Mr. Balkan back at you. Um, I know I made a video of this uh, just the other day, yesterday actually. What I'm going to do right now is I'm just going to test it. I'm actually going to test this fan with the thick 4 milliamp um, battery. This is the off brand, the battery I'm always bragging about. And they work great, half the price of the actual Ryobi brand. So let's try this with this. As you see, this has four bars. They all light up. So we're going to see how long this runs. And I'm actually going to put this, well, let me pause and see when I'm going to put it on. I don't know if it's going to be too loud on high. It actually doesn't matter. I'm going to go ahead and put it on high and let it run on high because that's the only setting I'm sure I'm going to use. And let's see how long it runs. So I'll, I'll check periodically and, and add different clips and show you all as far as the battery level goes. And uh, I already went over the features. I just wanted to add one other thing. It does have a little handle here. So not only do you have your handle and you got your hooks there and your screw holes at the bottom to screw it on a wall and a little hook there to hang it up on whatever you want. You know, you, you got many mounting points. So anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and hook the battery up. As you know, you can plug it into a wall too. Plug an extension cord in there. Snap that in there real good. So that's there, and, and I like how it's not flat on the ground. So even if it was mounted to a wall, you could still get to it. So there you go. You have your low setting. Let's turn it on. This is the low setting. You can hear that pretty good. And here's the high setting. Man, that low setting feels pretty good. But that high setting, that'll dry some carpet there. Anyway, let's let it run on the high setting. And um, right now, what time is it? All right, so it's 7.43 p.m., a little bit of daylight outside. So uh, let's let that run, and uh, we'll get back to it here shortly. All right, so here's the 11-minute mark. Thing is blowing strong. Let's test the battery and see if it's still still up there. I'm sure it is. It should still have four bars. And of course it does. And like I said, this is not the original Ryobi brand. That might give you more power than this one. I don't know. But this on Amazon at 30 bucks a piece for that thickness. It has four and a half stars. Um, I don't see it doing much better. Sometimes the off brand is a little better on certain things. Um, all I know is when I had the thinner Ryobi brand, that thing ran out quick. And I can do a lot of work with one of these. I actually have two of them, one's charging now. So yeah, it's still going. So uh, we'll add another clip here in a minute. Uh, I'll print the next video, the next clip, more than likely will be um, when it's uh, to two bars. Or maybe I'll just check in about 30 minutes or so. What's up everybody? So we're back with another clip. And yeah, uh, supposedly this is 4 milliamp. So supposedly, you know, it's been an hour so far. We still have four bars. I should be able to, after uh, watching some other videos, I should be able to get minimum at full speed, four hours to maybe five. Now, we're going to see. We're going to keep testing. But uh, yeah, on low setting, you could probably run this thing all night. This is the high setting, as you can hear. And... Um, yeah, I should get about four hours, if not more, out of the high setting. So we're going to let it run. Uh, we're an hour in, and this battery's still going. And this is the off-brand Ryobi battery, as I mentioned before, 4 milliamp. This 4 milliamp is $29 on Amazon. You can get 6 milliamp in this basic, generic brand, 6 milliamp, for like $35, $39. Now, I've had those for a little while. So... Shoot, you might want to go with the 6 milliamp. I know the 4 milliamp battery in Ryobi brand is uh, $99 at Home Depot, but it is um, $79 or, or $69. Uh, I kind of forgot either. Uh, what was it? What was it? Um, yes, yeah, right. $69 on Amazon. I've seen one, but they go for $70 or, or $99 at the store. Anyway, we'll get back to you with another clip once. Uh, this battery is halfway and then we'll give you the final results at the end. What's up everybody? All right, we are two hours in and we have three bars left. So just uh, check it in with you. See you on the next clip. All right, this is still going full blast. And we are three hours and 20 minutes in and we still have two lights. Two lights are down and two to go. So if two's down, been going three hours and 20 minutes it's safe to say 
we should at least get another three hours out of this. If not a full three hours and 30 minutes. So I'm gonna guess this fan will run at least six hours, but it might do six and a half to seven. We'll see. Can't wait, stay tuned. All right, so it ended up dying after, uh, just after one o'clock at 104. So this fan with a four milliamp battery from Amazon, the off-brand version, will run five hours and 21 minutes on full throttle. So you can just imagine if you had it on the lowest setting, there's not even a middle setting, it's just the lowest one. You can probably get 10 plus hours out of this fan, or expect at least, uh, you know, minimum nine, I'm thinking at least 10, hopefully, but we'll see. We'll do that test another day. Just know you can have this on full blast. It's gonna last you over five hours. This is four milliamps. It can get you a five or six milliamp battery off brand. Those are a few dollars more. You're gonna get more run time out of it. All right, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll talk to you on the next vid. Hey, what's up, everybody? So I did a test on the low speed, and the low speed, I started it at 6.30 p.m., and uh, it ended at 6.15 a.m. I just so happened to wake up about 5.55, and it was still going. I did a couple things, and when I came back in, it was off at between 6.15 and 6.10, or 6.10 and 6.15. It had to have died somewhere around there. So, um, yeah, this thing went almost 12 hours. We're calling it um, 11 hours and 44 minutes. It'll definitely get over 11 hours with, uh, with this battery, 4 milliamps on the low end. So yeah, there you have it.